Hey everyone, this is Alex, your host of Crypto World HQ podcast. Um, if you guys would like to check out my podcast, make sure you guys visit my website. You can get my link directly in the description. Also, follow my Instagram at Crypto World HQ. And today, I just want to um, explain quickly how to sync your Brave rewards with your desktop rewards. Um, I know a lot of you guys are, you know, wondering how to withdraw the bat that you earn um, on your mobile device. Um, and so far, what I found, there isn't actually a withdraw option on there um, as of now, um, at least on the device that I'm using. Um, so what you can do, and I'll show you here um, shortly, but um, what you can do is um, you can sync it and so the bat that's earned on your uh, mobile device will go into the the desktop and then from there you can withdraw and I'll show you that in a second but um, for those who don't know what Brave Browser is I just want to go over it very quickly it's a new um, internet browser and I'm gonna show you here on their website in a quick few steps here about it and so pretty much what they do is they block data grabbing ads and trackers um, so as of you know you guys know when you're browsing a lot of website you know uh, data mine your information you know your your uh, websites that you visit and everything like that and then they sell it and then they make profits from your information and then they target you with ads that you know they they got information from 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 you um, well brave shield um, pretty much blocks all of that um, cookies and trackers and and it also blocks ads and of course you could modify it in the settings to allow certain things on certain trusted websites to show and and you know all of that but it really looks out for you and your privacy um, so that being said that you know they block all that nonsense it makes browsing faster because it's not you know loading all those things on your you know on the background so it actually speeds up your browsing and saves you a lot of time um, another thing here is um, you know you can browse more privately with Tor that's built into the browser and that you know encrypts your you know connections and it'll increase an anonymity and you know it's pretty much like a private mode um, for those who want like full privacy in browsing and then with the the big thing here that I'm sure you know a lot of people are here is you can earn rewards and you can earn crypto by using the browser and their crypto token is called bat and you can turn on brave rewards and earn frequent flyer like tokens for viewing privacy respecting ads um, you can set the number of ads you can see per hour right now I believe the max is five and you can also um, um, support your favorite uh, publisher or um, you know creator with the tokens that you earn um, you can also turn that off so if you like to just you know hold it all for yourself you can also do that and then you you know you can spend it on gift cards you can cash out and you know there's a lot more to come with this but um, right now you know I've been using it for like about a month now and um, so you know I, I I know a lot of people are trying to figure out how to withdraw of course you have to set up an uphold account you know when you create an account they'll explain that to you and it's pretty much just a digital wallet that um, I, I guess works with brave and then when you withdraw on the desktop it'll go into there but first um, if you're on you know your mobile phone um, right now I'm on my desktop but it's pretty much you know the same thing because if you're on your mobile phone what you'll need to do is you'll need to go through the little hamburger on the top right um, the top right of your uh, browser or it might be on the bottom right if you're on your phone but you pretty much just want to get to the menu or the settings and then you'll find sync and so I think sync will be under settings on the mobile phone so once you hit sync here when you're on your phone um, you know it'll ask you you know um, add new device but it'll probably be your first time so to, so just click on this is my first time syncing and then it'll um, something you'll have a pop-up it'll look like this it'll ask you what do you want to sync with another phone or tablet or a computer depending on what you guys want to choose um, you know here for instance I, I would choose a computer I already synced um, you know I already synced a few days ago 
and but once you sync with you know once you click computer it'll ask you if you want to um, sync with a uh, code or the QR scan um, if you choose the the code it'll give you a phrase a key phrase and you'll want to save that you'll want to copy it and save it somewhere you you don't want to lose it because you know you'll need that for future reference um, and then once you implement the key phrase on your uh, desktop um, it'll sync up and then it might take a little while um, for it to show on the on your uh, BAT rewards here um, you know it might take a little while to for it to come up here but um, you know eventually it'll show up there and then um, you know once you're you know have your wallet verified and you know you're ready to cash out you'll see a withdraw button um, you know you can click on it and you'll see withdraw funds so right now you know I got a 6.2 bat estimated pending rewards on my mobile phone I have a lot more I think I have like 13 bat pending which is like three dollars almost four dollars there you know one one fifty six on the browser right now you know I spend a lot more time on my phone which a lot of us you know probably do um, and then you know uh, the next payment day would be February 5th which is today sometimes I did notice that you know it's not always on the 5th it might be like a day or two at least last month that's what happened to me I didn't get it exactly on the 5th I had to wait like an extra day or two but just keep an eye on that and yeah I mean that's pretty much it if you guys have any questions um, you know make sure to give my page a follow I will be posting more videos and more podcast episodes featuring guests from the crypto world community and stay tuned for uh, future episodes and make sure you guys hit that like and I'll see you guys in the next one